Okay, so we're at my new casting location, my new second shop that I, I'm going to use for machining and casting. And so I made this sandbox just for casting. And it's, it's nighttime out, but <clears throat> I want to get this done anyway, so I got the spotlight on. And we're going to try to pour this cylinder head again. So I'm just going to play this, uh, you know, fast motion. I'm going to skip through it because you guys probably know the drill by now. Plus I want to get this done before it gets too late. Damn it, it's upside down. Alright, now I can just put it on the ground right here. Oh my god, didn't cut gates again. What a waste. Okay, it's the next day. Um, what happened yesterday was, one, I forgot to cut the gates again, because <laughs> it's been so long. <laughs> and uh, two, <clears throat> the crankshaft I used was steel, not cast iron. So 
So next day we're going to try again. I'm going to bring you back when I'm taking the pour because, I mean, I feel like you've seen it enough already. <laughs> okay, it's the next day after work. It's dark again. This time I cut channels. <laughs> and uh, we're getting there. Hopefully this one will be good. This, this top cylinder head is cursed, man. Okay. <laughs> out of fuel so I'm just gonna go until I run out and then I'm gonna go for it hopefully it's good I have boards down because the sand is wet and I don't want any steam explosion so I'm gonna put the cruise ball on the boards so the boards are probably gonna catch fire but uh, it's fine so don't be startled about that Didn't have enough. This part is cursed. It is official. Well, it's only been like 15, 20 minutes since I poured it. Um, I don't usually take it out this early, but uh, I'm pretty sure it's not viable, so I'm dying to take a look. still red hot <laughs> um, <laughs> I guess I'll give it a little bit of time okay it's actually the next day and uh, brought this inside so now we're gonna see how this turned out it's been killing me I had to wait all the way until after work Let's see I mean I'm pretty sure this isn't viable but uh, we're going to see. Ow! It's hot. Oh, yeah. Not hot. Sharp. flat because we didn't have enough this part is cursed so I cleaned it up a bit um, you can also see that the the flask I was using is not the best again that was my first flask I ever made it's pretty old and uh, this the patterns kind of the two halves kind of shifted a little bit offset from each other you can kind of see it there 
So um, I'm going to have to melt this down and uh, start again. Uh, so that went pretty well. This one side really dipped down there. Um, so I think that'll be okay. And then there's the uh, extra. So we'll see. So you can see what I did this time. I um, put these boards on so I can <laughs> push the top into the boards and line it up. Because again, this this uh, particular flask doesn't have the alignment pins that I usually have, <laughs> so I'm gonna leave it for about five or so hours, and then I'm gonna come back and we're gonna see if this is a success. Finally, I'm having good hopes that it was, but uh, we'll see. Later along the line, I'm also gonna try to melt some silicon into the iron. Uh, it's supposed to make it less tough. So we'll see how that goes, but <clears throat> I'll bring you back in five or six hours. Okay, it's seven and a half hours later. It's uh, still a little warm, at least here, so I'm assuming it's going to be warm on the inside. Hmm. Cooling down nice and slow. I think this one's good guys it's looking pretty good finally man I'm glad I was able to take you with me on that endeavor all right uh, I think I'll clean this up off camera in the usual way you've seen me do just grind off these risers and scrape it off with this first and then use a wire brush and then a grinder so oh man I'm, I'm very happy very excited to be machining a new casting so I'm going to show a little bit of this I just went in with that pry bar and scraped off most of the outer sand and then I went in here with the grinder ground some of that out let's see if I can uh... there we go That should be good. I'm machining most of that away anyway. So, let's uh... Alrighty. That's it. We're finally done casting this part. We've lifted the curse. Very excited to finally start machining this guy and I can have a top cylinder head and then we can finally be you know have the whole cylinder enclosed um, so after this part is going to be the valve body and then a couple more parts on the valve body small parts and then that whole top end will be done super exciting so that's going to be it for this video thanks for watching guys I will see you later